Hello everybody, welcome to Let's Clean Up with Shin and Midori. A game where Shin is having a hard time cleaning up his room. So Midori is here, apparently, to help us out here. So we're gonna check it out. Uh, I just decided to find this game, it seemed pretty interesting. Hi, before we start, can you tell me your name? Do not be afraid. This is necessary, okay? Okay. Uh, I guess I'll just be Joe. I'll be Joe in this situation. So, your name is Joe. Great. I truly hope you enjoy your role. Well, I hope so, too. Uh, uh, this is terrible. When it comes down to my own mess, I just can't seem to care. Even when I wash my hands a thousand times, the truth is, my room is so dirty. That clothes piling looks like it's about to swallow me. I need to clean all of this. At least the living room and the kitchen aren't as bad. Thanks to my mom. <laughs> uh, I need to lay down or else I'll... Huh? Uh-oh. Midori? What's that? Someone trying to break in? Uh-oh, Midori. What are you doing? Uh, it's getting louder. I need to... Picked up my cell phone and pillow in case I need to defend myself or at least cause a distraction. I hid in the closet, trying to hold my breath as best as I can. Oh no. Oh no, please don't come near me. Please don't come near me. I hug my pillow and shut my eyes. Oh gosh. Why did both my parents have to go on the day of the trip? <laughs> That's very unlucky of you. Am I gonna die? Am I going to? Shin, where are you? Shin, I'm coming to help you, so... Oh. Oh, come out now, Shin. I was just fooling around, okay? It's just me. How did he... Should I look for you? Then, well, I guess I'll have to. Look around. Until I... Find you. Oh. Oh! Oh, that's creepy. He's just staring into my soul. Uh huh. Were you hiding from me, Shin? Uh, maybe? I don't feel anything. I don't exist. Do not perceive me. I am just a human sled. <laughs> Shin? No, he's not here. <laughs> uh, how did you... Wait, I'm still inside the closet. I need to get out, but my legs won't move on their own. Hayori Kun smiles widens as he approaches me. He, he knows. He knows. He almost gave me a heart attack. Uh -huh. Stop being so shy. Come here. Oh, before my thoughts kept running wild, Hayori Kun... Takes by takes me by the wrists and pulls me out of the closet, beaming at me as if he didn't w just scare the heck out of me. I already smiles at me as if nothing's wrong. My legs are still wobbling when I pull back, free from his tight grip. I don't blame you, so Shin. I caress my wrist as I speak. What are you doing here, Hayori Kun? Ah, oh, not that I'm bothered. I'm just curious. <laughs> How would he even get in, though? I don't know. Broke through that window? Well, it doesn't look broken. Ah, oh, but he's always does that. I sigh again, and Hayori-kun seizes the opportunity to raise his hand and ruffle my hair. I can't even tell him to stop messing it. Well, I will. It's already a mess as it is. <laughs> like I told you, I came to help. Ugh, you can't do anything by yourself, so I'm ready to help you out. The way he's grinning and shining, as if he didn't just say something mean to me right now. Eh, you're awfully close, too. Ah, but just that's how Hayori is. I'm sure he doesn't mean anything bad by that. Oh, I don't know about that one. I allow myself to be embraced even if I'm not too fond of it. When he finally pulls away and I'm able to breathe normally, I notice once again we were where we were standing, my room. I got tired just by looking at it. Thanks, Hayori-kun. I'm sorry to bother you with this, though. It's just too much. If it's just too much, you can... Ugh. I jump. I already pressed his insect finger against my lip. I can feel my cheek turning red from the heat. I quickly turn, look away. He laughs at me. Ah, oh, that's cute. Believe me, Shin. Nothing is too much when it's about you. Haha. <laughs> uh. Is that supposed to be reassuring? No. That is not reassuring at all. The way he said it. Ah, <laughs> uh, no. I'm thinking too much of it. I shake my head. So, uh, we need to start. Yeah, we need to clean this whole mess up. <laughs> yep, yep. We need to, uh, first, we need the proper attire. Proper attire? Hayukun rushes towards the living room without any explanation whatsoever, but quickly comes wearing a... Is that an... An apron? <laughs> is that Kai's... Oh... Bruh, is he dead in this timeline too? An apron, this will be useful. Uh, isn't that my mom's apron? Okay, good. <laughs> okay, at least it's not Kai's. Okay. I guess it's bad that it's also my mom's too, but... Oh well. When I raise my head to look at Hayori's, he tilts his head, smi smiling wily at me. 
Actually, he's staring intently. It's creeping me out. Ugh. No, wait. Does he want me to say something about his apron? Uh, what do you think? Do I look good, Shin? Uh, where'd you even find it? <laughs> even though we already know. <laughs> Hayori-kun's happy expression changes. Uh-oh. He looks serious. His eyes are glaring at me as if they could pierce me in my soul. He's intimidating me. Uh-oh. I made him mad. I look away and soon enough I noticed I'm trembling. Get out of here, S S Shin. You're scary. So Shin doesn't like it, huh? No, never mind. I'll take it back, right? Quote, unquote. Shin probably prefers to do this all alone, right? Shin probably prefers to be alone for the rest of his life, right? So maybe I should stop coming in. Oh, no, you, you, you got it all wrong. I was surprised. I couldn't say anything because I was surprised. You look good, I promise. I, I'm quick to say, stopping Hayori-kun from taking off his apron. He grins. Uh, what do I feel like I've been toyed with once again? Because he is. Okay, then. Let's start. Look at all this clothing on the floor, Shin. You need to pick it up. Uh, yes, I. I'll start doing it now. Maybe then I'll be able to find my wallet and keys. And my beanie. Oh, yeah, your beanie's missing. Uh, let's m make it fun, Shin. Uh, what do you mean by that? Make, make it fun. Let's see how good your memory is. Some of your the stuff must be lost under those piles of clothing, right? You must need to find them, so match the same items to win. Okay. Pick up the clothes and find the items to win. All right, let's do that. All righty, that's that. Oh. Oh. All right, laptop, laptop. Oh. Uh, this. Oh, gosh, I don't have much time. Okay, we got that. Keys. No. All right, this is that. Oh, frick, uh, uh, frick, oh, dang it. All right, uh -huh. I'm so tired, I can't breathe. I look up to Hayori-kun. Uh-oh, what are you doing? I see, your memory isn't working best right now, but that's okay, we can work on that. Oh, no, Hayori-kun, why do you get behind me? He's gonna kill me, isn't he? In fact, it's a great opportunity, huh? Shin, you're always so good to me. What is he? Now, Shin, I'll need you to look straight into that lamp over there. See? Ugh, lamp? What lamp? Are you going to blind me? Or am I getting brainwashed? I can't tell. What are you? Uh, what is with this weird light? Huh? Aha. Uh -huh. You know, Shin, I do need you to be in top condition. If I at least want to kill you with my own hands. Oh. Bad ending. Memory loss. Okay, so we did wash my memory. Okay. All right, let's just do the other option because I didn't save, so I guess we have to do it the other way. Eric smiles, pulling me in for a hug once again, squeezing me tightly. Oh, I can't breathe. You're so cute, Shin. I could just cut you into tiny pieces, cook you up with some sweet corn, and then gobble you up. Oh, that is oddly specific. Ugh, my face exactly. What? I tense and I think he noticed because he releases me with a loud laugh. Of course, he pinches both of my cheeks before actually letting go. Ouch. Poor, poor Shin. Okay, then. Let's start. Let's look at all this clothes on the floor, Shin. You need to pick it up. Uh, yes, I. I'll start doing it now. Okay, so it is all the same here. Oh, wait, is it? Alright, it's randomly generated. I expect as much. Alright, let's see. Hopefully, I can do it this time. Charlie should have saved. I'm being dumb. I'm being dumb. <gasps> All right, we got that. I don't think I'm going to get it this time either. All right, we got this at least. Uh, all right. No. Okay, we got it. We're going to do it. Oh, one second remaining. What? <laughs> I literally did it under the time limit. It said one second. Oh. All right, here we go. Yay, we did it. Oh, I did it. Ah, I'm so t so tired. Oh, but wait. Whoa, I've been looking for this everywhere. Yo, Shin's got his beanie back. I think it was right under my nose. So you lost your beanie, Shin. Well, I don't think lost is the word for it. <laughs> uh, but he, I kind of had a gut feeling that th this was a... I can't read today. A gut feeling that is was around here. Ah, uh, that's good. That's good. Shin's memory is really good. Thanks, I guess. It proves just how intelligent he is. Cut the thought. Ah. Uh. Alrighty. That was, uh... I mean, thanks for helping me out, Hayori. I mean, we kind of just did it. He just kind of instructed us to do it and killed us if we didn't do it in time. 
Hopefully we'll be able to clean up this sooner than than expected. <laughs> That's the spirit. Shin's so cute, isn't he? Um, well, well, no time to slack. There's still so much to do. We won't put on your beanie now. Oh, uh, yes. <laughs> there we go. Hey, there's the Shin that we know. Even though it's the same Shin. <laughs> now, I wonder. Hey, I know we just started, but can we take a little break? I couldn't sleep very well yesterday, so... Okay. Let's sit down and enjoy each other's company, okay? Ah, oh, oops, I didn't mean to do that. All right, you don't need to uh, do that. Get that close. Ugh. Uh, too close. Yeah, I'm not too fond of this. Maybe, uh, hey, Arikun, want to play a game? Uh, a game? Yes, yes, a game. Huh. <laughs> uh, but you have to move a little bit. Hope you don't mind. Uh, okay. If Shin says so. Wow, it worked. So what's this game about? All right, we got another game going. Yes, so here's the game. Haha. <laughs> I actually don't know what to say. Haha. <laughs> Come to think, come, think fast. Don't let them see through you. Ah! I forgot. I, uh, I did not expect that to happen. <laughs> well, I guess I, is it the same ending? I just want to make sure. I, th I think it is. All right, yeah, it is the same ending. Video game! All right, let's just go video game. Look, look. Oh, uh, is that yours, Shin? No, it was just lent to me by a classmate, but... I haven't had the time to give it back, <laughs> Huh. But, huh, but you see, I stopped playing because I got stuck in this place. Alright. Oh, he's got the Nintendo Switch! Okay, that's cool. I'm sure Hayori-kun can beat it. Uh, is it enjoyable? It is. What they playing? Are they playing, like, Animal Crossing or something? But quite difficult, you know? Oh, that's probably not. Uh, that's what my classmate's partner said, at least. But I'm sure... Oh, it'll be a piece of cake for you. I thought. Uh huh. You're so funny, Shin. Mm -hmm. If all you wanted from me was some help, you you just had to say so. Now Yorikun reaches out his hand. I quickly hand him the console, expecting him to beat the boss first try. After all, Yorikun seems to be good at everything, and when he is not, he stares, rambling about how the game could have been better with some extra coding. <laughs> Man, he sounds like a gamer. It's kind of nice to see him like this. <laughs> Harry Coon really hates losing. <laughs> yeah, sounds like him. Oh. No way. I can't beat it, Hayori Coon. It's too difficult. You're doing good, Shin. The game just needs some fixes. <laughs> Fixing. Please don't try to fix it. Oh, is he gonna like break it or something? I wanna try and beat it. Okay, if Shin says so. <laughs> yes. But the truth to be told, I just wish he could give it back to Joe. <gasps> oh yeah, I forgot I'm Joe. Okay, break time is over, Shin. We played a lot, but there's so much work to do, so... Oh, you're right. I almost forgot. <laughs> you need to take care of, of organizing things around here, okay? Like, for example, you really need to pick up that brick of milk and that monster and that bowl of cereal. Yeah, I know that already. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. I'll leave this to you. I'll take the, these dirty clothes to the laundry, okay? But my underwear... I think it's better if I don't say anything for now. Okay. Harakun picks up the loose clothes and takes them away in the laundry basket towards the laundry room. Okay, Shin. This is your time to run out the window and escape. I can't help but sigh loudly. I feel less stressed when he isn't around. Not that I don't like him. Harakun is my best friend after all. Well, that's kind of sad, honestly. It's just, he's scary sometimes. Oh, whatever. I don't have the time for this. Let's see. There's lots of things I should organize around here. Time to organize this mess. Okay, so I need to do this. I guess click on stuff. Oh, is, is that monster energy? And he's got a calculator on his bed. Interesting. All right. Am I getting everything? What's this on his computer? Objects found. Okay. You did it. What does that say? Job? Oh, yeah. That's his other jobs. Objects found. Good for job, me. There we go. Oh, yeah, there's a little Midori plush there. Oof. That was tiring. What? I do think my room looks a lot better this way. <laughs> huh? What is this? Under my sheets, there was something hidden. Oh, uh, this is the Hayori kun's camera. Knowing Hayori kun, he'll start taking pictures of me. I wonder, should I hide it? Uh, I'm gonna save before I do anything. I'm gonna hide it. I'm, I'm gonna hide it. He does not get his camera back. 
Uh, I think it'll be better be better hidden. I'll just throw it in my closet. Yahoo! How, how are you doing, Shin? Hey, perfect timing. It's almost done. All that's left is to sweep, right? I'll get to the the broom and I know that. Ericoon pulls out a broom from behind the door. I thought you might need a broom, Shin. Oh yes, I actually I was actually thinking about that. <laughs> that's because I know Shin very well. Even though anyone could have guessed that. The situation is kind of funny, so I can't help but laugh as well. Uh -huh. Thanks, Ayorikun. We're almost done. I can't help. I can't thank you enough for your help. Although I feel like he's been pushing me around more than helping me out, but... I already told you, Shin. I'll do whatever when it comes to you. You say so. Anyway, I'll be done soon if you want. You can. You can. Why is he looking at me like that creepy? Were you saying I should go, Shin? Uh... Oh... Well, no, uh... I just thought you might have other better things to do as well. But if... If you don't, that's okay, too. Uh, I get it now. You're worried about me, right? You think I'll get bored by hanging around and doing nothing? That's not it at all. Yeah, no. Oh, uh, don't worry. I'm sure you'll be done in a blank. Sure hope so. Hey, Ayurikun, would you like to? Huh? Whose phone is that? Pretty sure Ayurikun said he didn't own one. Ayurikun looks angry. Uh oh. No, no, that's not it. He looks. Why is he? Huh? Oh. Whoops, oh, oh, sorry, Shin. Didn't mean to scare you. Just remembered I had to meet with someone. Yep. Can't stay any longer, sadly. Woo! Get out of here. Okay. Thanks for coming, anyway. You really helped me out, Ayurikun. It's nothing really. Oh, Eirikun takes off his, his my mom's apron and hands it to me quickly. His expression. Is he Well well, gotta go. Bye bye, Shin. Yeah, hopefully I never see you again. Man, poor Shin. <laughs> Feel bad for him. How weird. Eirikun seemed afraid of something or someone, maybe. That seems to be the case. Well, I still need to sweep the floor, so. Ah. I'm worried about Hayuri-kun. I hope nothing bad happens to him. Neutral ending. Done. Alrighty. We got the neutral ending there. Now, nah, I'll just leave it here. It's his anyways. If I'm lucky, he won't do anything with... Yahoo! So, how are you doing, Shin? Oh, hey. So, this is kind of like the same dialogue, I believe. Left is to, uh... Eh. That's my camera! Uh -huh. I'm assuming this is the good ending. Yep. <laughs> Come on, Shin, a tiny little smile for the camera. Uh, yep, I did this to myself. I can't even get mad. Say, Hayori, I feel like the neutral ending's probably better than the good ending. Say, Hayori Kun, what's about wrapping things up first? I will smile properly when I do so. <laughs> okay, okay. You're getting so much better at having things your own way, aren't you? What is that? So what's left to do? Whatever. Well, I still need to sweep the floor. Oh, you're right. All of a sudden, Hayori-kun pulls out the broom from behind the door. That you might need one. Uh, thanks, Hayori-kun. Almost done. Can't thank you enough for your help. Although, I feel like he's been pushing me around. Alright, we've read that dialogue. Since you've been doing your best today, you deserve a reward of some sort, don't you think? A reward? Yep. So do your best, Shin. Leaves the room, chanting my name and clapping. <sighs> Hayori-kun acts like a child sometimes. It's kind of cute. If only he wasn't such a scary person most of the time, yeah. Uh, how I'm glad that I'm- that- Ah, uh, how glad I am that humans can't read minds. Oh well, beggars can't be choosers. Time to sweep! Ah, finally. The room looks decent. Yahoo! Ah, uh, you're in high spirits. And your room looks great too, Shin. So, come on, come on, it's time for the reward. What? All right, what's our reward? Before I can say anything, Hayori-kun is already pushing me out of the room towards the kitchen. Wait, the smell. You made corn soup, Hayori-kun? Yep, you did good today. This is what you deserve. Ugh, thank you so much, Hayori-kun. It smells so good. Can't wait to dig in. Glad to say so, Shin. Glad you say so, Shin. Now come here and say, ah, uh, oh, ah, uh, oh. Oh, I think he can do it himself. True ending, let's see, all right. Cool, so I think that's all the endings that got here. 
So yeah, that was just a fun little interesting fan project I just found on itch.io. I'll link the game in the description below if you do want to play it out yourself. And if you have any other Your Turn to Die fan projects that you think I should check out, I'll leave it down in the comments below and who knows, maybe I'll make one in the future. I did not expect this to be 24 minute long recording, but I guess that's just how it is. It doesn't matter. Thanks for playing and thanks for making a pretty good game. Anyway, see y'all in the next video. Bye!